hey guys what's up hope you're doing fine welcome and welcome back to my channel thank you for always coming back to watch my videos to support me i really really appreciate and in case it's your very first time to come across this youtube channel welcome my name is d mwango and please consider subscribing let's get to 100,000 subscribers and let me know what you think about today's video so sorry sorry about that but um today from the title of the video you guys like i'm really really heartbroken from what is going on and i just want to be honest i want to give you my honest opinion and what i really feel and whatever i'm going to say is nothing but the truth according to my own point of view and for those who are smart you can also tell it is what it is so recently uh i've been seeing like lots of bullying going on you know on social media in that d mwango who who i'm the one trying to copy whatever this content creator uh is doing who is miss Trudy. for those who don't know her you know i don't care if i'm giving her you know clout and and stuff but i just want to express myself so miss Trudy did a video you know and i just went and commented because she's one of the people who you know who i look up to like i love what she does i love her energy that's that's the reality so i went ahead and commented you know she did this video of quitting youtube for a for a eight to five job and i said you know i just remembered when i was you know doing my teaching practice and i remember those days where i could wake up so early go to school and you know life was life was not the same because you understand you have to keep time their records so i just commented on a good note and that was it i had no bad intention you know but after commenting this guy who is a big guy on social media who is misuri's boyfriend who is wodemaya he went ahead and said i hope you know your creativity is too high here i hope no one copies this and you know misuri went ahead to say yes i beg you you know and you know people were commenting interacting and everybody knew you know wodemaya was just aiming d mwango because you know what am I had a problem with my elder brother who is Ayamara, you know, I was not in their issue and actually I don't know even who Odemaya is in person, I've never seen him apart from seeing him on social media, you know, and from the fact that they had issues with my brother of which they sorted them out but it looks like it's not yet done done. So Odemaya went ahead and said I hope, I hope nobody copies this and Miss Rudy was like yes. I beg of, you know, and people are, you know, people are like, you know, what is this man talking about, you know, and, you know, for those who know what it is, for the smart people, they definitely knew what am I talking about, D Mwango, and my name was all over in the comment section, you know, and I was like, you know, what the hell is this guy, what does he want from me, you know, like, I was so heartbroken to see this, because this guy is close to a million subscribers on YouTube, you know, he's doing great, you know, you know, but he doesn't respect himself, he doesn't respect that he's a great man, you know, so I don't know what he's up to, but I just want to say so strongly, Wademaya, I know you'll watch this, please leave me alone you know if you have problems with my brother maro just you know just tell him but don't bring the bad energy to me and guys for those who have been following me for a quite for quite some time you people know like i really work hard for myself and i'm so proud to say that like i've been working hard for myself since day one and i'm i am maro's product who's my elder brother i knew nothing to do with youtube he's the person who came and shared the idea with me and he has invested in me since day one up to date as we speak and when i was down there with with nothing you know with with 100 subscribers with with nothing i mean no one was there and this content creators were there the likes of miss trudy you know she was a content creator but no one was there to help me out or do something i'm not saying like i wanted them to help me out but you know i was nobody i was i was nothing you know and i remember there's this time my brother came to kenya and so many content creators could come and they wanted to do videos with my brother and i was there but you know like i seemed to be nothing nobody was like d let's do a video because i had nothing i had like let's say six thousand subscribers and they were they were up there you know with over 100 so d Mongo was nothing to them and i respected that i didn't force issues you know so i was the one who was like please can we do a video you know but for them they didn't bother i was like nothing to them so many of them came around you know they know themselves but nobody wanted to do any video with me so after mara has invested in me after working so hard trying to be the waters by myself it's now that now they feel i'm copying them man like from nowhere why one 
why were they not saying I'm copying them from the beginning, you know? Why is it that it's now, you know? And what made me feel so bad is that, you know, it's after I commented on that video is when this guy who doesn't respect himself, who is Wodemaya, who came now and commented. For those people who are smart, you can go and check the comments, you know. You can go and check that video out, you know. It's after I commented is when Wodemaya commented, you know. Like he didn't comment first before seeing my, my comment. He came after and he was like, I hope nobody copies this. And I'm like, man, like, who are you? Like, you know, you feel like you own, you own the whole world, like you're the founder of everything, you know. And there's nothing new on YouTube, you know. And this guy, you know, he's just, he's just dealers for nothing. And I wonder why he can't be contented, despite the fact that he's too successful, you know. Like, he has millions, close to million subscribers, he has the voice, pretending to be, you know, like, bringing Africa together. But the, the, the fact is, he's a, he's a fake pan-Africanist. Like, you know, he's just that guy who's trying to be good out here, but deep down, and when you just see, you know, when you go deep, you will find like you know he's the person who is trying to but you know to do divide and rule you know just causing chaos then pulling out pretending to be too smart and you know make us seem that we are the ones who have problems with him personally guys i don't know even how the Maya looks in person i don't know and miss trudy you know i'm sorry to say but this is the thing you know miss trudy started being my friend just recently when when now she she knew d d is doing a good job maybe you know that's when now she started being close to me and for me, I've never begged anybody for a collaboration, you know, she's, you know, she knows, even if, she, you know, she can come under test, you know, like, I never even asked her for a collaboration, you know, she was like, D, we can do something, and I was like, yeah, we can do it, you know, because me, I have no problem with people, I'm never afraid that this person will surpass me, after all, I'm, I'm not in a competition with anybody, you know. I just thank God for the small steps that I make and I'm like, yo, I didn't have this, God. Thank you so much for giving me this. So even when she came, she was like, D, let's do a video together. And she was like, which ideas do you have in mind, D? Le let me know. Then I gave her a number of ideas, including the collaboration video that we did, Hawking. You know, it was my idea, you know, Miss Trudy, you know that, and it's true, you know, and I, we did it, and it got a number of views, which is good, I was really okay with that, you know, and actually I went ahead, shared the video to my people, to my community sub and stuff, but the video that I did with her, it was like, you know, she, she didn't bother, she didn't even post it, and, you know, I, I just asked myself, you know, why, why is she behaving this way, but I didn't even ask her, like, you know, why are you not posting, why are you not sharing my video, because I was like, ah, just, just, you know, it's okay, it's fine. If she doesn't feel like doing it, it's fine. After all, what I know is God has good plans for everybody and my bread cannot be your bread and my your bread cannot be mine, you know. Everybody is successful in her own or his own ways, you know. So since then, she, you know, she's just, let me just say, let me just be honest and Miss Ruli, this is the thing and you know it better and you know this is what it is. She's just a nice pretender, you know, she'll call me, we'll talk, you know, she thinks, I don't know, you know, she thinks maybe D is down, but you know, she calls, I listen, she tells me, oh D, you're my favorite Kenyan content creator, I'm like, oh wow, you know, but deep down my heart, I know, you know, this girl maybe has her own hidden intentions, just trying to be close to me because of her own non-intentions. And when Wodemaya was like, you know, I hope nobody copies this, you know, they are one, you know, you know, Miss Trudy and Wodemaya, in, in, you know, everybody knows they are dating, so when when Wodemaya comments something, of course, Miss Trudy knows what she's saying. And I went to Ghana, and, you know, Wodemaya comes from Ghana, but it doesn't mean he owns Ghana. Like, everybody has the mandate and the authority to travel wherever he or she wants to go. And I went, did this video of, you know, looking for Van Vika, and I found him, you know. It was not planned. It was just, you know, it was just an, an, an idea that you people asked me, because I remember I did a video, and you people were like, D, go look for Van Vika. And the good thing is, I found him. And that video got good views so what am i feeling like i'm copying me through these ideas because you know she also did the same thing here in kenya looking for who was it looking for saudi soul or something and to be honest it's my brother who started that idea looking for looking for he did that video of looking for tupac he was the first person to do that video you know so many people copy my not not copying like they have the same title i uh titles on their videos as my brother you know wrong route so many people have it you know but he never complains like you people are copying me like stop it and you know and all that but you know this guy who has so many subscribers is too jealous of my small of my small thing man and you know 
what do I just get contented with what you have, man? And you know, life is not all about numbers. Life is not all about, you know, YouTube stuff. There's this other life where you need a peace of mind, you know, and just get contented with what you have. Don't feel bad when other people rise and try and try to do their best and you see like they're becoming successful. You feel like you're dying. Like, what the hell? You know, like, what's going on in your mind? And that tells me something that, you know, human beings will never, you know, will never get satisfied with what you have. And, you know, you, you just find, like, a multi-billionaire is getting jealous of, you know, of a person who is close to nothing. And you wonder, you know, like, what the hell, you know, just get contented with what you have. And please, leave me alone, you know. I'm not thinking of quitting YouTube because of you, you know. You're trying to bully me on social media, but... I just want to tell you, like, I won't stop doing what I want to do. And, you know, you also copying other people's idea. Whatever you're doing, you know, is not really new. Like, it's not on social media. It's there. So I don't know why you feel it's only you and your girlfriend that people are copying you from. I don't know why, you know. And why me? Like, so many people can't, they're close to the same thing. But I don't know why you feel it's only D. Mongo who is copying. And when I was down there, you could not talk about me. You could not see me copying. Now that I'm trying to do my stuff, fix, fix my stuff, and now you're feeling I'm coping, please leave me alone. If, if, you have, st if you still have problems with my brother, sort them out. I don't know you. You know, I'm so young in the field. You know, you started long, 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 long ago, you know, together with your girlfriend. You know, that's none of my business. Just leave me alone. Just give me the peace of mind. Stop, stop trying to bully me. You know, like, I have my own right. To ha you know, I have a right to have peace and do whatever I'm doing. And I just thank God YouTube is not somebody's, you know, it is not some, you know, like, it's just a free platform for everybody, you know. And I don't understand why you feel so bad about me. In that, guys, can you imagine, like, I can do videos with people, like, you know, I can do a video with her girlfriend and she can comment and stuff, you know, I can do videos with other people, she can watch, but for me, she can't, you know, she can't, like, you know, she, she pre he pretends to be like, you know, he doesn't know the other person who is doing the video, so that tells me, you know, he knows about me, you know, he sees, he can see me and he knows, you know, but the way he's behaving is too weird, I've never asked you for like a, for like a collab and I'm not looking forward to do any with you, after all, I'm where I am because of you know, God's grace and my subscribers and my family, you know, it's God, you know, it's not through you or through your girlfriend or anything, you know, I'm just trying to fix my own, you know, by my own and just see, you know, see how I can work out my stuff. So please, with the my respect yourself, leave me, stop bullying me on social media. We're not even of the same age. We're not, you know, we, we don't relate in any way or the other. And please, Miss Trudy, just be true. You know, be, just, just, just be true to yourself. Don't pretend to be good. Don't pretend you love somebody when you hate her. You know, just be true to yourself. Stop pretending, man. Because I know what's going through, you know, you know what's going, you know what's going on, you and your boyfriend, you know, you know, you know what you're after. So please, don't pretend to be too good to me, whereas, you know, you know, you know, like, you, you, you know, you, you got nothing to do with me. Please, just be honest and leave me alone. You and your, and your boyfriend, just, just sit down, do your own stuff and just give me a peace of mind, you know. Like, I think that thing is, you know, that point is made clear and please leave me alone once more. Mind your own stuff. And guys, I want to say, you know, like, you know, like, it's not really good to go into other people's life and try to feel them they're nothing. Let nobody stop you from doing what you're doing. You have the right and never allow somebody to make you feel you, you're not worth it. You, you count, you're great, you have the potential within you, and don't make somebody deem your light. You know, like what Odema is trying to do. Maybe he feels now I'll quit YouTube. I'm not quitting. I'm not quitting. I'm, the, I'm there to stay. You know, I'm there to stay as long as I'm alive, you know. And, you know, I don't care. Even if you have, tomorrow you have 10 million or billion subscribers. Good for you. But please, stop bullying me on social media. Let me do what I can do best. And just, just leave me. Just leave me. If you have problems with Mara, go, 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 go talk to him. Leave me alone and leave my family alone. Just, just leave us. Stop pretending that you're too smart so and you're trying to come out so clearly, you know, like, you know, you create trouble, then you try to pull back so that we can seem like, you know, we're the ones who are having issues. You know, please, stop it. And Tim D, thank you so much for the support. We'll still continue working hard as never before. Oh my God, you guys, they're just giving me the other energy to do what I can do best. And 
you know, I just want to thank you. You know, road to 100,000 subscribers by the grace of God, we're going to make it. They can't stop us. What God has put in place for us, we'll get it, you know. And if you're from Miss Trudy and if you're from Odemaya, that's what it is, you know. Pass my information to them and just tell them, the Mongo wants her peace. Like, you know, don't try to, to make me feel like, you know, I can't do it. You know, I'll do it definitely like never before. Man, as long as I'm breathing, as long as God gives me life, you know, I'll never give up. I'll still push. So I think that's going to be the end of the video. I think the point is clear. You know, I hope, I hope they won't do it again, you know. And if they feel they are the owner of YouTube, you know, <laughs> let them do what they want to do. But stop tarnishing my mind, trying to bully me, trying to make me feel like, you know, I'm nothing, you know. Like, I'm also successful in my own way, and there's nothing I can be f afraid about. So, Wodemaya, please leave me alone and stop being a fake Pan-Africanist. You, you're so fake, man. You're so fake. And you're trying to cultivate that in Trudy to also be fake. You know, like, she calls me, we talk, I think we are together, but that's not the thing. You know, they talk behind the bars, you know, how I'm copying her and stuff. So, please just stop it. Stop it and be true to yourself. Anyway, I don't want to talk much. I think that's that's it for now. And guys, I wanna see you soon on my next video. I still have lots of videos from Ghana. Even if Odemaya comes from Ghana, he doesn't own Ghana. I'll go back there over and over again. Okay? So yeah, see you soon on my next video. Bye bye.